Hello. Thanks so much for being here. I hope you're all doing well tonight. I have the Necrometer app on my phone. The first thing that came through was Murder, 10, Say Your Name, Thermal, Zachary, Move West, and Watch It. Cheryl. Cheryl. Paranormal. Paranormal. There's just like a million words coming through. False. If you haven't tuned into my videos before, I do portal box sessions. I have a F7 spirit box. It's a scanner. It scans FM radio frequencies. And I plug it into this device. This is a J portal, so it's like an amplifier for it. I wanted to do another video in the Sebastian Rogers case. I saw that it's been like over six months now since he's been missing. And I think it's such an odd case. And before I was seeing, you know, that I thought the mom and the stepdad did something. And then I thought that Seth was innocent, just looking for his son. But after really thinking about it, I feel like maybe it could be more than that. It says Stefan. And the reason I think that is... I think that Seth has had some strange behavior in the case, like sending out cease and desist letters to people that are searching for Sebastian. Doesn't make sense to me. Like if you honestly had a child missing, you would want everyone looking, you would appreciate everyone's help. And the things that he said, I mean, he literally got angry, he told people to F off, you know, and then sends these letters out and he's got this PI with them. And, the GoFundMe and just all the behavior to me. The paranormal music box keeps going off. And like I said, you have to be kind of in front of it for it to go off. <laughs> but I think it's strange behavior in all, you know, all of them, the parents, Seth, and I wanted to say, like, there's been a couple times also where I did a couple of portal box sessions and I heard it say Seth on the spirit box. And I just thought it was just kind of saying it like, you know, that's my dad. And like I did hear Sebastian or someone come through and say, I love my dad. You know, he loved me. And, and then when I talked about the parent, like the mom and the stepdad, it said things like abuse, things like that. So you don't really know what's going on. It says news. But I'm wondering now, I'm almost suspicious that maybe they all know what happened. Like Katie did something. It was an accident or like maybe she over medicated him because I know she was giving him like sleeping meds. I'm going to reset this. It almost makes me wonder if Seth knows and he's protecting Katie. Maybe he still loves Katie. Maybe he's hoping they'll get back together. You know, maybe that's what this is about. Because then think about even in the beginning when people asked him when the last time was he saw Sebastian. He said, oh, he was with his mama leaving the barbecue place. They had a nice dinner and they went out and had fun which was kind of weird to me too. Like that was his last meal or he had a day of fun before they got rid of him. I don't, I'm not sure, this is all alleged. I wanna ask the portal box what it has to say about it and just see if something will come through that would tell us like if all the parents are involved, if the dad knows. So I have this image of Sebastian Rogers. I'd like to get information about where he is, what happened to him, and how many people are involved in his disappearance. I wanna know if his parents are involved. If my spirit guides are here, can you come forward and say hello or, or help me get info about this little boy? Where is he? Tommy. Sound like it said an angel. I said, I heard something Tony in the beginning. Is Tony helping the situation or hurting? Tony's the PI. Is Tony? He 
here to help find Sebastian, or is he just here for like monetary reasons? Construction, which the stepdad is in construction. It says Judith. Who's Judith? Can you tell me where Sebastian Wayne Drake Rogers is? Where is he? They put him away or they hit him away. How many people are involved in Sebastian's disappearance? They got my name. It says Ghost Hunter. <laughs> Sebastian Rogers, if you're here, can you say your name? How many people are involved in Sebastian's disappearance? Is it his dad? Mom and stepdad, yes or no? So I can set Sebastian. He loves me. Who? Your dad. I love my dad. I'm dead. Does your dad know where you are? My dad does. Where did they put Sebastian? Tragedy, and that said incorrect. Can you tell me the cause of Sebastian's passing? Was he over medicated? Can you say that? Or was it an accident or foul play? I'm dead. What's your name? False. What happened to Sebastian if he was not over medicated? Was he hit with something? Was he suffocated? What was the cause? And then I heard something about the head. Unconscious. Who hit you? One hundred. Were you said got in a fight? Did Sebastian get in a fight with his mom, Katie? Yes or no?
get it now. Was this done to Sebastian on purpose? It was. Why? What exactly happened on the night that Sebastian went missing? Something, it was my mother. Was this tragedy? Nine. Was this done on purpose? It's her fault. I'm just saying what I hear, <laughs> but I don't know. I'll, I'm gonna listen with the headphones, but I feel like I'm getting responses. It's at a fight again. Did Sebastian and Katie get in a fight? It sounded like it said they did, and then it sounded like it said they were fighting. What, what did she do to him? She beat him in the front. Was this planned by Katie, yes or no? Yes. Why? How did they dispose of Sebastian? Was he thrown in the trash? <laughs> Was he at the dump? Stand by. Positive. Was he at the dump and they missed him? Yes or no? Who's talking to me? <laughs> Who's talking to me? Say it again, loud and clear. 49. 49? 49 what? Sebastian. And I heard tragedy like three times. <laughs> His mom did. <laughs> How did they dispose of Sebastian? <laughs> the car something? <laughs> Abigail. Was this pre-planned by Katie? Is that why she took him out for popcorn and barbecue? And was she planning this? Yes or no? <laughs> What's his cause of passing? Drowned? What? Drowned? What do you mean? If he was over medicated, can you say over medicated? <laughs> I 
it said dimension. I heard this say grandma. How many people are involved in Sebastian Rogers' disappearance? How many people know where he is? Sounded like it said something about a boat and it said para para ferry. I don't know what that means. Is Sebastian Rogers in water? Can you say water? The law. The law. Is is he in a body of water somewhere? Yes or no? I'm going to do the Ghost Seer app. I want to see what will come through. Can you give me a picture of where we can find Sebastian Rogers? Dog the Bounty Hunter is coming to look for him or may even be looking now. Is he going to find Sebastian? Where would Dog the Bounty Hunter need to look for Sebastian Rogers? Is he, if he's in water, can you give me clues? If he's buried, can you give me clues? Before you gave me an image of a cemetery. Sorry. Where should Dog the Bounty Hunter go? to find Sebastian. <laughs> Who should he talk to first? Who knows? We need to find this boy. What? Who's that woman? I have this picture of Doug the Bounty Hunter and his late wife, Beth. So I want to see if it's possible that maybe Beth will come through and give dog clues as to where to look for Sebastian. She's a strong spirit. I remember I talked to her before. I don't know if you saw my video with her, but she came through strong. I think she helps him. Beth Chapman, if you're here, will you come through and say hello and say your name? It's me. By the way, I heard a woman. Is that Beth? Can you say your name? I swear it sounded like it said I'm oh, Beth. Mm. <laughs> He's crazy. <laughs> Beth, did you know that Dog is going to search for Sebastian Rogers? Like, what clues could you give me? that would help Dog find this little boy. I'm trying to find the boy. Now, I spoke with you before. Do you remember talking with me? Are you able to help Dog find Sebastian? Can you do that? It said, I can help, and then it sounded like it said, I'm smarter. It's a tragedy. 
through the What clues would you give Dog when he goes to search for this boy? Should he talk to Katie? Like, is she responsible? Should he speak with her first? I'm like, some like patience, visual, seven. Beth Chapman, do you know where Sebastian Rogers is? Is he in water? Yes or no? Is he buried? It sounded like it said they chewed him up. It was a tragedy. Where is the boy? We just we need to find his remains and he needs justice. Can you help him? Like, what clues would you give Doug to find the boy? It's an image. Right now. Right now. In Nevada. Up in Nevada. It's a woman running from someone. It looks like she's being chased by a man. She has a black dress on. You can't really see her face. But I'll put that on the screen. It's a woman running from a man. Interesting. I think it's a guy. Can you give us an image of where to look for the boy? Like, we need clues. Like, is he near a cemetery? I just say. Is he in water? Is he buried? He's special. He's special. Beth, what messages would you have for a dog to help him find the boy? Where would you tell him to go first? I'm 47. First timer. First timer. I This is weird. It looks like some kind of like a building or structure, but then it's next to water, and then there's green trees behind it. Where is this place? Is this an abandoned building somewhere? It's red. I'll put that on the screen. That's interesting. Are you saying that he's in water? Or near water? Is he in a building? Is he buried in a building by water? Another image right away. It's like a white, a little white house and it's all green around it, green trees, green grass. Where is this house? Is that where a dog should go first? There's a secret. Three p.m. So he should start at the house and talk to Katie. And then Sebastian is near water in a building. If he's buried, can you say buried? Mm -hmm. 
You have to say, like, the boy. There's another image. This is, like... This is a picture of, like, hooks and stuff hanging on a wall. Like, straps, hooks. So, I mean, again, it looks like the inside of, like, a barn or something. How far is this from Sebastian's house? Can you tell me that? How many miles? Do you know the name? Near the water. What water? Straight across? Where? How many miles? Can't find it. Can't find it? Is this like an abandoned building? Yes or no? What's the name of the city? A shadow man with the looking at a light inside a building, I think, inside a room. I'll put that on the screen. What's the name of the water that you're saying that he's near? Where where is that water? What's the name? A victim. Does Seth know where Sebastian is? Kind of? Tragedy, again. It says, look on top and then seven. Are you saying seven miles? You said 90. Then I heard seven, like 97. Is it 90 or something? Is he in the same state? Is he in a container? Infamous. Infamous. Couch. Is he buried near a school, a cemetery, or a church? Community. Beth, if I leave the room, will you give us more clues and talk to Dog and tell him where to go? If I leave the room, will you do that? I don't know. I'll try or something. Can you give Dog more clues? We need to find the boy. Can you help? It sounds like it said, I'll try to. Is Dog going to find Sebastian Rogers? Yes or no? Group of us. It sounded like it said emergency and then by an airport or something. I heard airport. What airport? Did Chris Proudfoot leave work and race home to help Katie the night that Sebastian disappeared? And does he know what happened to Sebastian? What did they do to him? Why? 
What's the reason? Are they just annoyed by him? What's going on? Underemployment. It says locked and then underemployment. Was it hard to pay for him? Is this about money? Yeah, it is. Were they going to have to pay child support or something when he went to live with Sub? Is that what this is about? And do you think that Seth is still in love with Katie? Is he protecting her? Does he know? Yeah. I think it said he does. I heard Beth. If you could give us any clues or anything that could help Dog find him, then you just go ahead and say whatever you want. I'll be back. said construction again and it said underemployment ignore and then it said gambling and then video that's interesting construction twice is he near a construction site I said yes what construction site a house dead Why did you say construction twice? Pre-planned. It said pre-planned. By who? Sure. 
He showed up from work. Who? Is Katie involved with Sebastian missing? Can you say her name? They're hiding things. What about Chris? Information. Information. What about Seth? Does he know? Album. One bad spirit. Some, said something about midnight. <laughs> Who's responsible for disposing of Sebastian? <laughs> I really want to know if his dad is involved. Well, Beth, if you're still here, do you have anything else to say that would help us find the boy? Um, it sounded like it said I'm there to help my man, and then it was all previous. My family. How many people are involved in Sebastian missing? We got it. Vincent. It sounded like it said three got it. Do you have any more messages for dog that would help? Water. The water. Well, water. I heard an answer. Is Sebastian in water? It sounded like it said they buried him. Where? Man, I heard a lot of responses coming through, but if you heard anything that I didn't hear, Jennifer. which I feel was probably a lot, Jennifer, then please comment below. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, I appreciate you tuning in. And if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. And I will talk to you soon. Have a good night. Bye. Thank you.